<clears throat> hey everyone, this is Jose 32 back again with another card trick, and I'm using a hope deck because I need a little hope and a little luck for this trick to work. <clears throat> anyway, it's, it, this is an interactive trick. You can see why it's called the interactive, not in a minute. Um, this was done, this is one trick that I saw on the Son Farkware DVD. It's one of the only ones that I saw that, I, if not the only one that I saw that I hadn't seen before. So I thought I'd say it with you. Like I said, it's an interactive trick. So get your deck of cards out. If you don't already have a deck of cards out, I don't know what's, why not, because I already did an interactive trick earlier today, and you should still have that deck of cards handy. If not, go back and get it, and come right back here, pause the video, and get back here. Alright, you should have a deck of cards with you now. You can give them quick shuffle. You can do riffle shuffle. Oops, you can do shuffle. Overhand shuffle. Whatever shuffles you want, shuffle the cards up. Give them a cut. And now take any nine cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine cards. Get rid of the rest of the deck. And you'll see that these are completely random nine cards. Oop. And now what you can do is shuffle up these cards. <clears throat> and look at the top card. In this case, I got the Joker. You will have any other card. You can have any card. I don't know what it is. I'm not going to figure out what it is. But I will try to figure out which one it is. And now, just to make things a little more fair, take the bottom card, place it on top of the pack, so now your selection is second from the top. And now what we're going to do is this trick is going to use a little bit of me, a little bit of you, and a little bit of magic. What I want you to do now is I'm going to spell out your name first. I don't know what your name is, but we'll use the name Dave. I'll spell it out. D A V E. You spell out your name, whatever it is. All right. And then you take these. The rest of these cards. And place them on top of this. Just like so. Now we're going to put me in this and we're going to spell my name. Victor. V I C T O R. Drop these cards on top of there. And now a little bit of magic. Let's spell. And what you're going to do right now for the magic part is basically deal off any amount of cards you want. Oh. Any amount of cards just like that, put the rest on top, we are done. And now it comes the part where I try to figure out which card is yours. And I may or may not get it, hopefully I get it. Let me know how it works out. By the way, I highly recommend you check out Son Farquhar's website and especially his YouTube page and all his awesome tricks, especially his card tricks, because he is just awesome. So now what I want you to do is take the top card and show it to me, alright? Just put your card up like this to the screen so that I can see what it is. No, that's not your card. Get rid of that card. And now I want you to take the next two cards. Put them on the screen so that I can see them. Mm, no, those aren't your cards. And ignore what my cards are for the time being. And now take the next three cards. Put them up to the screen. Mm, no, that's those are not your cards either. I take one more card. Let's try the next card. Put it up to the screen. Mm. 
Yeah, that that should be your card if all things worked out well. Let me know if that worked out well. It's not the King of Diamonds looking for. It's if this card that you're showing me right now is your selection, wonderful. If not, it should be the very next card, whatever it is. And actually, bingo. There's my card, the very next card. It really, I think, depends on how many letters are in the names, how many cards you shuffled, but there's my card, the very next card. Yours could have been either one of those. When I when I did this trick while doing watching the Son Farquhar DVD, it was that very next card. It was that first card that I showed you that was my card. But now, obviously, when I did it, my card is the very next one, and that's how it always seems to work out. But anyways, hopefully it worked out. If it didn't, oh well. Let me know if it worked out, if I got your card right. Or not. And maybe try to trick yourself. It's pretty simple. And it's pretty cool. <clears throat> Alright, now. I've done some card tricks. I've done some... Other stuff. I've done some... I looked at my DVD collection. I did some tech reviews. And I may have time for one more video, so we'll see what happens. See you next time. All right.